Welcome back out to Athens following Georgia's final game of the season, losing to NC State in the Super Regional. Matt Stewart alongside me, a man who knows all about these Georgia Bulldogs. And after what was really an incredible season, what was maybe your biggest takeaway? The improvement in the program and what Wes Johnson brought to the program. 43 wins this season. I don't know that anybody anticipated the kind of vast improvement we saw in the Georgia program. Historic season, belting home runs, Charlie Condon coming back for another season when Wes Johnson became the head coach, you know, saying he would never go anywhere else while certainly he had opportunities in the transfer portal if he had chosen to do that. And putting together one of the greatest college baseball seasons I've ever seen. And he'll be one of the top picks, if not the top pick in the MLB draft. Yeah, incredible player. And it just speaks to what Wes Johnson's kind of done for this entire team. It feels like the guys he brought in and this offense fit this ballpark very, very well. How important is that as he tries to, I guess, build off of this year and head to the future? I thought one of the great ironies of the season was Wes Johnson, extraordinary pitching coach from LSU, the Minnesota Twins before that, Arkansas, Mississippi State before that. He comes to Georgia and they become one of the top offensive teams in the country. But I guess it takes a great pitching coach to know what great offense is too. And he was able to do that through the transfer portal and of course the return of Charlie Condon and Corey Collins. I think the next thing for Georgia is the improvement in the pitching staff. And I think he mentioned in his postgame presser that you saw a vast improvement in this Georgia pitching staff over the course of the season. They maybe got a little fatigued there at the end, but I think improving the pitching, improving the defense, and of course Georgia will be very active in the transfer portal in this offseason as well. The very good news is they also have some returning players like Trey Phillips. Just a freshman this season, was an absolute superstar. What can you say about his performance in his first season here in Athens? Yeah, Trey Phillips was phenomenal. He had two home runs, six RBI in the three-game Super Regional. He had a three-hit night in the final game of the season. I think he's a budding superstar. He's got a great combination of power and speed. He missed two weeks during the middle of the season with a knee injury. Had he not done that, and maybe had he played a little bit earlier in the season as he kind of grew into his freshman season, he, I thought, was a legitimate candidate for freshman of the year in the Southeastern Conference. Didn't get it. But I think he's an all-SEC player going forward as soon as next year, and I think he's also a future MLB player. I think as somebody who's been around this program for so long, what can you say about this atmosphere? Incredible the last couple of weekends, especially for this Super Regional. I mean, you look in that field out there, packed house. I mean, what do you think it means for this program going forward that you have this kind of crowd support and what it can look like going forward? Well, it's been a long time since they've had this kind of atmosphere. You know, they made four runs to the College World Series during the 2000s, and they got to the National Championship Series and missed the national championship by one win against Fresno State in 2008. But it's been about that long with a few peaks, but a lot more valleys over those last uh, 16 seasons. And I think Wes Johnson brought back that intensity. The team scored a lot of runs. They averaged over nine runs per game. They hit more home runs than any team ever in Georgia history. They finished top five in the nation in home runs. That kind of stuff generates the crowd. People love to see the long ball, and Georgia certainly provided that this year. And I thought Wes Johnson brought an attitude to this baseball program, much like Kirby Smart has brought to the football program. Look, man, he kept talking about trying to build confidence into his players. And look, when you have the performance like they did this season, it gets a lot of confidence and a lot of momentum going forward. It'll be a whole lot of fun to see how this Georgia program continues to build going forward, but we'll have to see it come next season.